happy Halloween to everybody. Hopefully you guys are having a fun, safe day today. Let's get into this, guys. This is the biggest Halloween feast you guys will ever see on YouTube. Let me show you how easy it is to make the best Halloween feast ever. Don't blink. Let's start off like this. We're gonna make some meatball feet and meatball hands. So, six pounds of ground beef here. To this, one tablespoon of salt, teaspoon of garlic salt, one cup of breadcrumb, quarter teaspoon of dry basil, half tablespoon of chili powder, half teaspoon of ginger powder, one teaspoon of cumin, half tablespoon of black pepper, half tablespoon of white pepper, two tablespoon of paprika or more because I like paprika, tablespoon of onion powder, one teaspoon of dry thyme, half a cup of milk, three cracked eggs, Step into it now guys, take that beautiful clean hand of yours, get right into it guys, get into it very well. You got your meatloaf nice and combined guys, the tricky part, making one feet and one hand. This may not look like feet or hands right now guys, but just for you guys, I gotta cut the toes out. Just gotta lift that feet up. Shout out to all the foot fetish lovers. <laughs> <laughs> right my feet. <laughs> Low key, this looks like a foot too. <laughs> but it's a hand, alright guys? It's a hand. I have bone marrow. That's a small bone marrow for that feet there. Yeah. Chant in that bone marrow. And for the hand, jam this one out here. Lastly, I got some garlic cloves. Oh man, that's creepy, eh? Okay, once you got your nails nice and thrown in, all we're gonna do, take our feet, take our hand, toss them into the oven at the lowest rack or the second rack at 420 for about one hour, guys. Can't have meatloaf without some mashed potatoes. So I got some Yukon potatoes here. Oh, not Yukon, russet potatoes here. Also, you can't have a good meatloaf without the ketchup sauce. So I'm gonna do this ketchup sauce for the meatloaf and ribs, guys. One whole bottle of barbecue sauce going in. So this is barbecue sauce slash ketchup sauce for our meatloaf. Make sure you don't waste, guys. Throw some water in there. <laughs> then I got one cup of ketchup going in. Three tablespoons of brown sugar. One tablespoon of Worcester sauce. Two tablespoons of paprika. Mashed potatoes complete. All I'm gonna do, two tablespoons of butter going in. Half tablespoon of salt. Once I got this nice and mashed, guys, I'm also gonna season this with a tablespoon of onion powder. One teaspoon of garlic salt. I love that white pepper. One teaspoon of this. Also, since I got some leftover sour cream left too, I'm gonna throw all of this in. So half a cup of sour cream as well. This is it. Nice, simple, easy, fluffy mashed potatoes complete. Next, some ribs for our skeleton. So, three quarts of water here, one tablespoon of salt. I got two racks of spare ribs here. All I'm gonna do, toss them into the pool. I don't care if they can swim. I just gotta get in. I'm also gonna throw in a third cup of Worcester sauce too, just to give it that nice tangy flavor. Now, pop on the lid on the Instant Pot, and we're gonna cook this for about 30 minutes. There it is. These riblets, so these riblets do come with the ribs. So to this, we're gonna make a nice honey garlic deep fried dry rib. So to this, one tablespoon of salt, half tablespoon of seasoning salt, three cracked eggs, no shells. And last but not least, one cup of cornstarch going in for clean hand yours. Mix that all in guys, mix it all in very well. Mummy dog, so to make our mummy dogs, we need a short crust pastry. So to this, two cups of flour, shred in half a cup of cold butter. Make sure it's cold, guys. We're breaking your butter. Once you got it nice and broken in, half a cup of cold water. And all we're looking for, guys, come on, we know this. It's a nice soft dough. Always look for a nice soft dough when you make it short crust pastry. We know this. Our dough is nice and rested. So I'm gonna do, roll this out into, into a nice little thin sheet here. All right, once you got this nice and rolled out, guys, we're gonna cut little strips down. Once you got them nice and cut out, I got some hot dog here. Guys, if you have kids, make this with your kids. Your kids will freak out. <laughs> I would, guys. If I was a kid, I'll freak out. If my parents ever did this for me. <laughs> but my parents are foreign, so they don't understand this. <laughs> That's all good. I love my parents. Is that a mummy or was that a mummy? I don't know if that's a mummy or not. Kind of just looks like a, um, a 
sausage roll. <laughs> there it is. Mommy dog's complete into the oven at 420 for about 20 minutes, guys. Next on the list, very spooky dirt pudding. So I got some instant gel or not jello pudding mix here, which I'm just gonna dump in. So in this back here, it says one kilo bag of this needs four liter of milk. So that's one liter. This is two more liters. Here it is, guys. I'm not listening to the bag right now. I'm just gonna eyeball it. <laughs> Finish it off with this whole canister of whipped cream. Just to make up for that liter of milk. Nothing to this now. Whisk that in. Isn't this spooky or what? <laughs> Look how delicious it looks. She got that nice and mix into her glass plate. Oh man. <laughs> Touches for this. I got Oreo crumbs. Which I'm just gonna throw on, so it's gonna act like it's dirt. And I'm just gonna toss this in the fridge for the time being, just because I don't want to throw my worms and my other candies and spiders on top now. I don't want it sinking through. Lids are out, guys. All I'm gonna do: take our beautiful homemade barbecue sauce. I'm just gonna lather it on. And we're just gonna broil this and it becomes nice and crusty. Nice, simple rib recipe. Best rib recipe ever out there. <laughs> Last thing that needs to be cooked up, our dry ribs. So, take our dry ribs, toss it into the pool. Guys, nothing to it. I don't care if they can swim, they just gotta get in. Cooking time, eight to 10 minutes, guys. Kind of put this together. So I got this idea from, I think it was Buzzfeed. So they took a skull, saran wrap around it so the prosciutto doesn't touch the skull. Take some alfalfa sprouts, I'll place it down. I'll lay my, or rest my skull on top of this beautiful bed of alfalfa sprouts. So it doesn't move. Next thing they did, which I thought was genius of them to do so, was take prosciutto. Just like human skin, right? <laughs> and we'll just place this on. That's pretty spooky already, guys. I'm spooked out. <laughs> Alright, your head complete. <laughs> okay. On this side, I'm just gonna take all my alfalfa, spread it out a bit. Next, I got this salad here. I'll say this salad, out of all salads, this salad's the best. Once you got the salad all nice and tossed in, check this out, guys. I made peppers with faces on them, or jack o' lantern face on them. <laughs> all I'm gonna do, stuff these bad boys. Who wouldn't wanna eat this now, right? <laughs> This one looks evil. Stuff this bad boy. I set my man up. So I'm gonna give him some ribs. <laughs> we'll give my man a heart. Just go hard there. Got this sauce here, stinging honey garlic sauce. I wonder how this tastes like. And it's from Frank's. Oh, bratty kitties up. Toss this in. I'll place it right in the middle here. Mix on this platter here. And drop down some mash. Doesn't have to be perfect, guys. Supposed to be nice and spooky. Take that feet, <laughs> that crusted feet. 
right there. Look at this. This crusted hand. Right here. Throw down your spooky, very spooky mummies. How spooky is that? Too afraid to eat it or what? <laughs> Some may say these are smiley face. But let me show you guys close up to this. They're evil smiley face. <laughs> Just imagine, okay? You're stuck in, I say your car broke down and you need some help. Then this guy comes up to you, giving you this smile and you ask for some help. And he's just looking at you like this. Would you say these guys are still smiling at you? That's what I thought, guys. These are evil smiling face. <laughs> you know, they're smiling in the beginning, but when you cook them, they become evil. <laughs> Graveyard pudding. It may not look like a graveyard yet, but you wait. There it is. I got these sesame cookies here. Which I'm just gonna distribute throughout. I'm not gonna even touch this just because how spooky it is already. <laughs> you guys can have it. So spooky. <laughs> I got these spooky spiders. Makes you just wanna cringe every time you look at it, right? Who's cringing? <laughs> Got these bad boys. Worms. Disgusting. Right? That's disgusting. I got some of these. I'm not even sure what these are, but they look spooky. Right? Maybe a scorpion? I don't know, guys. Next, I got these jack o' lantern heads here. Very spooky. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying that, but it's spooky, guys. Look at this. I'll show you the other one. This one's laughing at us. I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, I'll put this one here. The amount of disrespect from these guys, though, right? They're the one that's laughing at us, not these jack-o'-lantern hats. <laughs> okay, some candles right into the mouth right into the mouth got some fire light them up last thing I got here is these bones on a rope look how spooky it is <laughs> alright what we're gonna do fan the spookiness around Oh man, that's spooky. <laughs> oh, look at this one. That's spooky. Last touches. Get some more of that blood. You know what I'm saying? Oh man. That's gotta hurt. Look at that. Just see this, I got some rosemary I found in the fridge. We'll just make a spooky tree right here. Oh man, I am for sure touching this. <laughs> Way too spooky for me. I forgot guys, I had this. It's called blood syrup. All I'm gonna do, pour this on his head. Oh man, that's spooky. I ain't eating this. <laughs> It's way too spooky. Oh man. Oh man. There it is, guys. Happy Halloween. From my family to yours. Make sure you guys check your kids' candy and eat half of it. <laughs> guys, come through. Come through the back, though. If you guys come to the front, I'll give you candy. You guys come to the back, just pick up a plate and help yourself. Guys, let it be known, the biggest Halloween feast has entered YouTube community. <laughs> okay, don't mind the noise in the back. My parents are just showing my cousins the house through FaceTime and 
Don't think they're yelling. That's just how they talk, guys. It's very loud. I don't know why they scream through, you know, the phone. I, I don't know. Maybe it's a foreign thing. I don't know. But let's just get into this, guys. So, I got the mummy. All right, it's a little cold now, guys, but it's okay. I got the mummy, the evil smiley face, uh, the short ribs. Not, not the short ribs. The dry ribs, the honey garlic dry ribs, and some ribs. And I'm just going to microwave this first, guys. All right, nice and warmed up. Here we go. The mummy dog, a little catch up there. Guys, take the first bite of this, quick time. Just got it, nice, pump for this. I'll tell you what it tastes like. <laughs> tastes like a hot dog with a beautiful bun on it. A beautiful buttery bun. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about anybody walking behind this guy, he's not a ghost. It's just my parents. I want to say this is your traditional Halloween kids food. Nice, simple, easy, or beer food <laughs> for the adults. Just need some beer. Mm, oh god. Oh. It's a blimp outside. I don't know why there's blimps outside. But it's beautiful. Alright. The rib. It's quick time. Nice. Pump for this. I love boiled ribs. I don't know. I kind of like boiled ribs more than smoked ribs. Mmm. Okay, that's amazing. Alright. The evil smile hash brown. <laughs> Quick that. Let's go. Nice. Pump this. Mmm. Here it is. Jack o' lantern <laughs> salad. Quick time, guys. Let's go. Nice. Pump for this. Now this is a fun way of eating salad. Mmm, 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 mmm. That kale salad is legit, guys. Mmm. -hmm. That's actually very tasty. Look at his back hair. Filled with nutrients. Vegans are drooling over this. <laughs> Wait, never mind, there's mayonnaise in this. Now, this is a feast, guys. Mm. Honey garlic short ribs or dry rib. Quick time. Let's go. Nice. Pump for this. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. That sauce is actually amazing. The Frank's honey garlic. Mm-hmm. Mm. The mac, put that. Again, guys, if you guys hear some yelling in the background, it's just my dad talking to my cousin. <laughs> it's a normal thing. When they talk on the phone, I don't know what it is, but they always yell at each other. Why? 
I don't know. You should see at Vietnamese wedding. You understand what I'm saying when you go to a Vietnamese wedding one day. When the karaoke machine goes up. When the mic gets passed on to them or they want to say something. Expect them to yell in the mic. Mm -hmm. Why? I don't know. <laughs> the mic is there for you to not to yell. But they always yell in the mic. I think it's the Asian thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want some of that meatloaf, but it looks really dry right now. Guys, I'm ready. I got a bucket full of candy ready. I got a fish ready for you guys if you guys want to come through. I don't know. I want to eat this head here. But it just feels wrong. It's creepy. <laughs> mm. Mm. This is what I want. The spooky graveyard here. Oh man. Can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> that is spooky. Alright, the spooky graveyard. <laughs> you gotta say it like that. Quick time. I just got it. Nice. I had this rig, so I know it's gonna be good. Pump for this. Mmm, 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 mmm. That's an awesome, spooky graveyard right there. There. A little of that tombstone there. I just got it. Nice. Pump for this. Mmm. Mmm. Oh man. Hmm. I know this is disgusting, but try it with the worm. Just got a nice pump for this. Not too bad. Hmm. That's amazing. I want a bit more of this, guys. New spoon, okay? This is the spoon I was eating from. I know you guys are watching out. <laughs> here, I want some more of this graveyard here. Oh, man. Another one. Guys, quick time. Let's cut it. Nice. Pump for this. Mmm. I ain't gonna lie. If I had this feast when I was young, I'd probably be the most happiest, happiest kid in the world. <laughs> Alright, time to have kids. <laughs> I gotta show my kid 
an awesome time of food. I just gotta do it. Time for a kid, guys. Who's the lucky wifey out there? <laughs> food and life's such a beautiful thing. Don't you think? Hope you guys enjoy this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Also, don't forget to pick up one of your food and life's a beautiful thing. Share. Or a pop one. Like, share this. Peace out. <laughs>